Okay, here's the question this week. Is it a better investment to buy an existing house or a new house? And um, you may be thinking this yourself or, um, you know, maybe you're trying to decide. I know when, um, when I've been showing here recently, um, people will either know, they'll know decisively whether they want to look at only new houses or if they want to look at um, existing um, and new houses. Nine times out of ten, um, the new houses usually went out if you're looking at existing and, um, and new construction. But I had an opportunity last week to um, sell a house um, to a buyer that bought the existing house over the um, new construction house. So it, it begs to differ. I think it, it happens um, where it really fits the family. Um, new construction, of course, in the marketplace in, in our area in Augusta is um, is booming. They we, we are very, very fortunate in our market to have new houses on the ground. Um, as the housing market recovers, you know, more and more markets will see more and more new construction, but we have been very fortunate to have a lot of new construction on the market. So we have some good builders here putting um, good quality houses on the, on the market. So that makes the existing homes very competitive and so while a new home you couldn't go into the builder and um, negotiate a lot on price where um, in an existing deal I think you have a little more um, opportunity to to negotiate a little stronger on the existing homes um, not to say that you should really you know pound the sellers um, on price and concessions um, my theory on um, pricing property is if or when you're when you're a buyer looking at making an offer on a house is you know look at the market and see what the comps are and if the property is priced fairly for the market then I don't feel you know you really should go in trying to you know milk the seller for everything um, that you can of course you want to get a good deal but who's to say the seller isn't already giving a good deal uh, for what the market is is holding um, you know, on the on the building side, you're really not going to be able to negotiate sales price um, in our market for new construction. You might be able to negotiate for, say, closing cost or some other things that you might need in a new house. Um, refrigerator comes to mind, privacy fencing, but that's really going to depend on the builder. They too may have um, a pretty good deal in the marketplace for for what the features that are already in the house, um, you know, might be. So. I think it really depends on the buyer, the buyer situation as far as family. Um, in my deal last week, there was really none of um, the new construction that were on the market in the area they were looking at that really fit the floor plan for their family. And the resale was a very good deal. They ended up paying, you know, um, you know what the property was listed for because it was already a really good deal in the marketplace. So, you know. They, they were able to find a very good deal at, in an existing home that fit their family better than any of the new construction that was out there. Not to say that they didn't like any of the new construction. Um, they thought the homes were beautiful, well constructed, um, but it just didn't fit in this particular situation. Um, so I think it really depends on the, the whole picture. It depends on, you know, what what your family is looking for and what's going to best fit your needs uh, for the real estate market. I think the argument could be made that a that can be made the a lot a lot of times when that question is is posed as far as um, whether an existing home or or a new home is a better investment. Most people would say a new home is a better investment because it's new. Um, it ha it's going to have you know all the new features and and as long as it's quality built and then, then it's already, you know, a good deal for, for the marketplace. Um, so, but I think there's a lot more to it. I think it just, it just has to be what's going to be best for your family and fits your family. Um, I also, to recap, I'll, I also think, you know, you, you can probably get a pretty good deal on the existing home, existing homes right now because, also because they know that they are, the sellers know that they are competing with new construction. In Columbia County, in our area, there's not one neighborhood that I really can think of that's not competing 
with some type of new construction, either very close to the neighborhood or within the same, you know, same area. So I think it um, it's bigger than just the black or white question of which one is a better investment. I think you can get a good deal on both um, in in the marketplace here. If you have any specific questions on maybe um, a particular neighborhood or um, you know maybe your house in general if you think you know your existing home just compared to to what are some of the other um, homes that are out there I'd be more than happy to um, talk with you about that so I hope this you know kind of shed a little light on it it was a question that I kind of pondered for a couple days and just wanted to get it out there till next time <laughs>